going to plant today y'all I am so excited I am beyond excited um, I know it was a long hard push for us to get to get to this point where we're able to plant there's a story behind that when we when Gracie was three years old okay we moved into our camper we had planned on living in our camper full-time well I had a beautiful garden I had started planting that was my first garden ever I had started planting and it was beautiful it was growing Gracie helped me do that garden and then one day she got burned um, she fell into an a fire pit and got burnt it was a really bad accident um, sometimes things happen and I had to leave that garden I had to pick up I had to pick up a whole life and leave that garden and um, just so I can give Gracie the care that she needed we were going back and forth to the hospital a good bit so I could not give her the care that she needed in the camper and plus I had had Courtney Courtney was a little baby so we picked up we left the we left everything everything just I didn't get to pick any tomatoes I didn't get to taste the fruit I didn't I just I just had to leave it and that hurts my heart that breaks my heart I cannot express how much hurt that I had to go through dealing with also Gracie seeing my daughter hurt and seeing something that I really loved and that I really had passion for just be washed away so my husband and I we picked up our family we moved into with our in-laws and that's where we have been since so this property it's it's special it's special to us and it's special to our family um, I know y'all don't see Gracie doing a lot of planting with me because she helped me plant that first garden and did not see the benefits early at that early on stage and did not get to taste and and to see um, the bount bountifulness that come out of that garden that's why she she doesn't she doesn't plant she doesn't help me plant and I understand that I I I understand that completely I'm hoping that one day that she will come around I really do um, and even even after she had her accident yes uh, the following spring I could have went out there and planted but she was still wrapped up her hands were wrapped up her knees were wrapped up she could not be out there in the sun because of her scars and because of her wounds she could not do it so that's why Grace you don't see Gracie doing a lot of planting and doing a lot of active work out here um, now she does like going to go do the chickens because she sees the she sees the reward that she gets from the chickens and we're going to plant this garden and I know it's just me out here today my husband's at work and my kids are at their grandparents house the girls had school and Levi was just still sleeping when I left the first thing we're gonna plant is the tomatoes you want to make sure that the tomatoes are planted um, quite deeply it can go up the stem the stem is actually the is actually a part of the root system like the deeper you plant the, the tomato plant the more roots that will come off of the tomato plant itself so the three types of tomato plants that I have is the black cream the super sauce hybrid and this the beef steak hybrid those are the three that I planted now I'm gonna tell you um, following this video or this little session right here I did not turn my mic on this morning and so I had to redo some of this stuff so 
Y'all just hang in there and bear with me. Alright guys, so over here in this corner, I planted, well not in the corner, I planted my super sauce hybrids. Now along the fence line, if you remember in the last video, we had planted beans. And I can stick my hand through that fence, so I'm not worried about as far as the beans um, not being able to get to the beans. Okay. And in the center of the garden is my beef steak. And I planted them a good four inches past the top of the potting soil. So they are pretty deep. And then over here on this end of the bed, I planted my black creme. I am super excited about these. I cannot wait for these to come up. I've never seen them before, but I'm always willing to try them. Alright guys, so over here is my banana peppers that was planted. In this section of the garden, we have the carnival blend. Alright guys, so next to the Carnival Blend, I'm going to plant the California Wonders. Um, it's a lot, these are a lot of like, more like of a bell pepper. They're sweet, they're not hot, they're not spicy. So these are the ones that we're going to plant because I know that Levi's going to come in and see these peppers and i got to teach him which ones are hot and which ones are not because they'll burn his mouth. So we're going to plant the California Wonders right here in the section. Alright, so our next pepper that we're going to plant is a sweet pepper. It's called a Chinese Giant. We're going to plant them over here on this side next to the orchard. Alright, so the next one we're going to plant is the hot cayenne peppers. Alright guys, so that's it for today. Thank y'all so much for watching and y'all have a wonderful day. Stick around for tomorrow's video.
because we're planting more.